Hello and Assalamualaikum. We have already learned chapter 1.2 which is molecular and structural formula. So today we are going to continue to chapter 1.3 which is functional group and homologous series. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to define what is a functional group. Uh, name the functional group, alkene, alkene, arene. Uh, classify organic compound according to their functional group. What is functional group? So functional group is actually, uh, it can be an atom or group of atom. Uh, for example, atom, it can be CL. Uh, group of atom, it can be COOH. So that is a group of atom. In an organic molecule, which characterize the molecule and determine how the molecule reacts. Okay, uh, Characterize the molecule means um, its physical properties uh, and how the molecule react. The chemical properties. Uh, do alcohol react with carboxylic acid uh, and so on. Okay, by looking at the functional group in an organic compound, we can determine the class of compound it belongs to. Okay, so let's see for the first one. Uh, class of compound. Okay, functional group. Let's say C3H8. Uh, that is not functional group. Eh? Okay, so what is functional group for the structure C3H8 if drawn like this? Okay, as you can see, carbon is attached to uh, hydrogen. All are single bonded. Okay, there are three carbon. That is actually alkane. You can also have alkane in the form of cyclic compound. Okay, cyclic compound C6H12. So what is the functional group for this one? Okay, so alkane actually have no functional group. Okay, because this is the simplest form of hydrocarbon. So functional group, none. No functional group. Eh? So next one, C3H6. Okay, what about this structure? Okay, there are double bond here. So this is double bond. It can also be seen as cyclic compound like this. So it is alkene. If it is double bond, it is alkene. So alkene, the functional group is carbon, carbon, double bond. You need to remember it. Eh? Do not just write down in exam, uh, double bond. You need to write down carbon, carbon, double bond. Because double bond can also be C double bond O, uh, C triple bond N. Okay, so you need to write down here, carbon, carbon, double bond. Okay, next one, triple bond. What about triple bond? Okay, this is triple bond, C3H4, triple bond. So it is alkyne. Alkyne, yeah? So that is triple bond. So carbon, carbon, triple bond. So obviously remember, carbon, carbon, triple bond. Okay, one chloropropane. One chloropropane, as you can see here, there... Uh, chlorine. There is chlorine here. So for chlorine, it is halogen. Okay, it is halogen. Okay, uh, chlorine, bromine, iodine, fluorine. Uh, that is halogen. Uh, group 17. Eh? So haloalkane. Uh, sometimes also called al alkyl halide. Okay, also called alkyl halide, uh, which is also the same thing. Eh? Okay, next one. Propane one all. Okay, you can see here there is uh, OH. So, it is actually alcohol. And the name for the functional group here is hydroxyl. Okay, hydroxyl. XYL. Okay, at the end here is XYL. Because uh, in some... Uh, naming, we are going to use the word hydroxy without the L. So for functional group, the name should be hydroxyl with the L at the end. Eh? Okay, next one. Okay, how many uh, functional group actually that you need to remember? Okay, 15 or 16 if you separate alcohol uh, with this one. This one is phenol. Okay, phenol is also alcohol. Uh, but we separate uh, alcohol from phenol uh, because phenol uh, chemically it react differently compared to alcohol. Okay, so that's why uh, sometimes we differentiate alcohol and phenol. But actually, phenol is also alcohol. Okay, so still hydroxyl group, and this one is phenol. 
okay propanoid acid okay so propanoid acid as you can see uh, there is the functional group here so carboxylic acid the class of compound is carboxylic acid but the functional group name is carboxyl eh? so this thing is named carboxyl okay next one ethyl ethanoid ethyl ethanoid so ethyl ethanoid where is the functional group so this part okay this part is the functional group eh? so let's see the proper one ester Okay, so that is ester, the functional group. Okay, the name for the functional group is carboalkoxia. Okay, what about this one? Okay, the functional group is different. Eh? Okay, what about this one? This one is not ester. This one is not ester. Actually, this one is anhydride. And the name is ethyl anhydride. Ethyl refers to two carbon, eh? so one, two carbon, so ethyl and hydride. Naming we are going to learn later. Okay, so the functional group is called and hydride. So the same, uh, there are few class of compound have the same name as its functional group. So this is and hydride, and functional group also the same name and hydride. Okay, next one. Okay, what if it is changed to only O at the center here. Okay, only O at the center. So this one is actually ether, diethyl ether. Okay, so that is the functional group. Uh, remember, you you cannot. Uh, if the question asks you, uh, circle the functional group. Uh, do not just circle the O. Okay, do not just circle the O. You need to circle like this. Okay, C O C. Okay, so that is the correct. A functional group okay the it is ether eh? so this one is alkoxy group yeah for functional group of ether okay next one okay is this carboxyl acid coh okay if you if you look from here coh is it carboxyl acid so let's see uh, propanal so this one is not carboxyl acid it is aldehyde different very different than alcohol it does not even have the feature of alcohol eh? okay so this is carbonic group eh? so carbonic group okay remember if you need to circle the question asks you circle the uh, functional group so this part that you need to circle the co the h is not included eh? co okay so this is carbonyl carbonyl group okay what if h we re replace with r R is alkyl, eh? alkyl chain. So uh, there is one R here. R, eh? R uh, I'm using R. R refers to alkyl chain. What is alkyl chain? Uh, alkyl chain is ethyl, methyl, propyl. Uh, that is alkyl chain. Eh? Okay, so this is one more R. Uh, so this is not the height. So ketone. Ketone, yeah. So still the functional group is CO. So ketone and aldehyde have the same car, uh, functional group, which is carbonyl. Uh, so sometimes it have the same chemical properties, okay? Because it have the same functional group. Functional group, if you uh, look again at the definition, is a atom or group of atom uh, that determines how the chemical react and what is the physical properties. Okay, we change again. So this one, C double bond O C L. So this one is acyl chloride. Acyl chloride. So is it uh, carbonyl functional group? Okay, acyl chloride. As I told you earlier, uh, there are some class of compound that have the same name as its functional group. So this one is acyl chloride. The functional group also acyl chloride. Okay, this one. This one is amide. Okay, amide. Okay, C double bond O and N. Okay, C double bond O and N. Eh? Okay, so this one is not acyl chloride. But it is carboxamida. Uh, carboxamida here, if you read in Bahasa Melayu, it will sound like Korean. 
carboxamida uh, similar right okay now co is lost uh, it's not shown here only n so is it amide no it is amino and the class of compound now is amine okay if you have n it is amino okay what about c triple bond n okay the functional group here is cn for the class of compound of nitrile and it is cyano cyano okay cyano okay and this one what is the functional group methyl benzene or like this okay uh, you should see that this conjugated double bond okay conjugated double bond uh, conjugated double bond means uh intermittent double bond uh, double bond single bond double bond single bond double bond single bond okay so this one is benzene ring or phenyl group the functional group is benzene ring eh? benzene ring and phenyl group class of compound is aromatic aromatic compound or airy okay so for aromatic compound or benzene ring it should have uh, this uh, definition actually uh, it should be cyclic lana and or base Huckel's rule okay this one this one is for aromatic compound for aromatic compound to be called aromatic compound it should have this uh, properties cyclic it must be cyclic so in this case this is cyclic uh, it must be plana so this compound is plana and obvious hacker rule hacker rules is 2n plus 2 pi electron uh, that one you are going to learn more in benzene uh, benzene topic okay or aromatic compound topic uh, for now you just need to know that this is aromatic compound okay so th so that's it uh, all of the functional group that uh, you should remember okay there are 16 actually 16 so let's try this one okay okay this one is carbonyl okay this one is carbonyl carbonyl group the functional group is carbonyl so this one is it aldehyde or ketone okay carbonyl if you remember it is aldehyde or ketone so this one actually if you look from here there is one r and there is also one r here so this one is ketone okay so that one is functional group is carbonyl class of compound is ketone okay next one so this one is the functional group carboxylic acid huh? so functional group is carboxyl class of compound carboxylic acid okay so that is the functional group carboxyl and class of compound is carboxylic acid okay next one cn so cn so this one Functional group is cyano. And function uh, and class of compound? Nitrile compound. Okay, so that's it for today. I will give you some exercise. So try to answer that. So that's it for today.